In this section, we will explain about the settings for Follow the Leader and Pinwheel. We will continue to create a sheet from where we left off last time. Add a new sheet. When you turn on the interval, you can draw curves at regular intervals. To draw a curve, place it temporarily with the pen tool and adjust it with the Bezier tool to draw it beautifully. The tool for creating curves is a difficult tool if you are not used to it, so we would like to cover it in another lesson. When creating a new formation, make sure that the performers do not touch each other while moving. Adjust while being conscious so that the intermediate progress looks beautiful. If you want to change the position of the performers, select two performers you want to change and select, switch position for the rest, from the Performer menu. Then, you can switch the positions of all the sheets from this point on. I arranged it like this. Now, from here, I would like to create a follow the leader. Add one sheet and place it at the 12 count position. First, create only the movement of the leading performer. Select the sheet in front and select the performer to be the leader. Click the free move button. Set the subsheet pitch to 3 and click the Create button. Free Move is a tool that can be applied to only one performer, and you can register positions continuously while creating a subsheet. When you release it while deciding the position by dragging the mouse, it is determined. If you turn on the interval, you can fix it at the specified interval. You can switch the interval on and off with the I key on the keyboard. In this way, you can click continuously and register positions while automatically creating subsheets. If there is already a subsheet, it will be overwritten. When it becomes the next main sheet, it will end automatically. Let's check it out. In this way, a movement that draws a circle while turning back every three beats was created. Now, let's set the follow the leader that follows this leading performer. Click the next main sheet. Select in order from the top. B. 
Because the leading performer is away, you cannot select it beautifully with auto order, and you need to select each one carefully. In such a case, move to the sheet in front where it is easy to select once, and select with auto order. To select cleanly with auto order, be conscious of the first and second performers, and add the rest without worrying. If the auto order remains on, the selection order will change like this, so turn it off and return to the next sheet to maintain the order. You can switch auto order on and off with the A key on the keyboard. Now that you can select, click the auto follow button. Leave the skip at 1 and click the decide button. Then, a movement that follows the lead like this is completed. It may look like it is following, but in reality, it is performing the action of moving to the position of the previous performer on the next sheet. I will create a follow the leader in the opposite way in the same way, but I will use a mirror tool to make it beautifully symmetrical left and right. Mirror only the leading movement and set the auto follow as before. In this way, a left right symmetrical follow the leader was completed. The properties of the tool will change whether to set from the sheet in front or apply on the back sheet. Please remember that free move is from the sheet in front, and auto follow is from the back sheet. Next, let's explain about pinwheel. Pinwheel is set from the sheet in front. Move to the sheet in front and select the performer. Click this button. Create with a subsheet pitch of 3 and a total count of 12. Click to specify the center of rotation. You can click anywhere on the screen, but for clarity, click and drag on the extension of the selected performer. Then, a trajectory is displayed like this, and when you release the mouse button at any location, a pinwheel is automatically created. If there is already a subsheet, it will be overwritten, and if there is none, it will be created automatically. Since the subsheet pitch is set to 3, it turns back every 3 counts and the movement becomes a bit angular. This can be resolved by making the pitch finer, but since the subsheet will also increase accordingly, I think it is better to set the pitch to about 2 or 3. In this way, by making full use of free move, auto follow, pinwheel, etc., various movements are possible. This is the end of this lesson. Thank you for watching.